welcome back to another chapter of mysql series today we will understand how we can fix the name of tables and uh, or you can say how we can give a alias name of table last in last video we understand about the uh, inner join left join right join and cross join today we will understand first we will understand how we can fix the tables name then we will understand how we can uh, use a self join okay so for example uh, last time we understand this right we use a inner join and uh, sorry left join and we know what is the left join and how we go but in this table we don't know from where we use the first name from last name and title right so that is why prefix the tables name or you can say we use a alias name for particular table for example if you have a column name like first name and last name sometime what you did you did concat and uh, then you give like first name like that i will write first name comma last name and as a full name you write like that so this is we call we have given the alias name for particular column but in today video we will understand how we can give alias name or how we can prefix the tables name so here it is very clear from mm means it is members table mv we use for the movies table so you can directly identify from movies table we got the title and from members table we get the first name and last name then we use a left join so every each detail we have no right so we will cover in this video everything so without any further delay let's get started okay so for example we will understand with the two table first for example we have table name by the name of director this is our director table the another table we will use select star from fill table right this is two table we have we already work on it early before okay here i want to know name of movie and director name from this two table okay so how you will find you will use the joins of course okay so we will write select like i want title right title is a movie name then i want his uh, first name and last name as a full name so we will use concat full name okay then we, what we will do from film what we need from film inner join director the another table on what is our condition for uh, joins it will be a common key is both table is director id right okay. so what we will do here we will write from director what i need director i need director id and director id is equal to from film table what i need dot director id so we will get all all the film name with their director so can you see here that this is the name of film and this is the name of director as a full name so you can find like that okay now we will understand first today how we can prefix the particular name i will take the same example what i did here i simply you can give any name as per your choice what i will do here for example this is our movies uh, table okay i give in the alias name as a mb and in the members table i give a alias name as a mm so here what we are gonna give we will give for this two name what happened you know this this is a small table but what if you have a large table like you want to uh, for example you want to take a 15 or 20 column in that scenario what if you will write again and again like movies dot title members dot first name or for what if your uh, tables name is like you know members underscore movies underscore title underscore first underscore whatever it can be xyz what if is your your, uh, your table name is like that you cannot give all the time like this you know this must be name then title comma this must be name dot type uh, first name so it will your query will become too lengthy and there is a chances to uh, that you can do some smelling mistake or you will get any syntax mi mistake am i clear 
okay so that is why we prefix the tables name or you can say we give a alias name for particular table okay so i hope everybody clear why we use a alias name or why we prefix the tables right so here what i did movies table i give a name as a mb and members table i give a name as a mm so i did same thing here title i take it took it from movies table but this is very clear to understand now if whenever you so share this query with your teammates or with your colleagues you can say so they will understand from where you took the title from you from where you take the first name and from where you take the last name because in from you have clearly mentioned that movies as a mb and you did left join with the members table as a uh, you prefix the name as a mm so like that you can prefix and you can give an alias name for particular table okay i hope everybody clear with this that how we can prefix the name of table okay now we will understand the self join here okay for example i have one table here as you can see here we have a employee id we have a manager id and may, we have a director id but if somebody will ask you what is the meaning of this manager id anybody has any idea okay so this is the employee id of steven this is the manager id zero but this is the employee id of nina and this is the manager id of 100 what is the meaning of this this simply it's showing you that nina manager is employee uh, manager id 100 so the manager is also an employee of company right the, he must have some id so if you ask me so then you can show him like so for example somebody ask you who is the volley manager so you will what you will do you will go here like that and you will find 103 then you will go here again, alexander okay so alexander is the manager of volley so in this scenario if somebody will ask you that uh, give me the all employees detail with their manager so you cannot find one by one right this is difficult task to do in this scenario self join comes into the pictures okay what we does we assume in this case we assume for example we have two tables only we have one table my mp but we will assume we have two, two table with same information but it's a manager table okay okay if somebody came and he asked you give me the name of employee with their manager name so how you will find that so what you will do select first what you want employee id right because you want to find the employee name with their manager you will write employee id then his first name and last name you can say you will write employee you can use first name last name as a full name also but i will use only uh, what you call first name right i will write first name then let me do it normally first then i will accept from my ear okay in this scenario what will happen you will get all the employee id with their name right you are getting all the employee with their name but we are not getting manager right so now what we will do i will write joins here join my employee okay if you will do like that what will happen you will get the error but in this scenario you have to prefix the first the table's name because I, earlier i tell you right that we have to assume here we have a same table so what i will do here i will prefix this my employee table as a employee and this my employee table again i will write as a mgr right manager manager okay here i'm taking here the employee id first so i will write emp dot employee then again i will write emp dot employee first name so we will get employee first name sorry employee id and his first name now what i want is manager name so i will write mgr dot first name because we have as you right then we will write here on this is our join condition right we will write emp dot mgr 
सॉरी एम जी आर आई डी इज इक्वल टू एम जी आर डॉट ई एम पी आई डी एंड वी विल गेट द कंट्रोल इंटर ओह देर इज समथिंग रॉन्ग ओह सॉरी आई राइट यू आर रॉन्ग Yeah, you can see here if you will hit control enter we will find all the name of uh, employee with their manager name because why it's showing two time first name you can give like this also as a as a m g m g r okay. okay so can you see here now you can easily identify the who is the uh, michael manager it's a steven but earlier what is happening here it is very difficult to find like for example i want to take david so who is the david manager i will go here i will find the manager id then i will come back again then i will say alexander is the uh, manager of david okay so but if you write query like this you will easily get to know that who is the manager of john kevin whatever it can be santa or whatever okay so it is very easy to find like that okay we just assume another table with the same name sorry same records and we write the, uh, we give prefix the their uh, tables name and we find it out and if you will share this query with anyone he will easily identify you use a employee table two time and there you give a alias name first for emp and then another uh, mgr for the manager or you can write the full name also and here I, what i did i get the first name as a manager name okay for example let's understand with the another example for example i have a table by the name of parent okay so for example i have table by the name of parent here i have id the name of the person age of the person and parent id now what if i want to know who is the parents of sara so i will go here i will find the parent id and then i'll go back so michael is the parents of sara so you want to know who is the parents of emily so you will go back here you will find six or oh, again come back and sophia is the parents of emily okay so like that it is very difficult to find when you have a uh, crores of data or you can say so it is very difficult to find like that so now for example here i want to find the name of the child we'll assume that this is the name of the child and uh, i want to know their parents name and age so how you will find we will did same as we did earlier simple way we will write the query like again we will assume that this table has same table we have one is we will call one table for the child uh, another table we will give the name of parents we will assume that uh, we will give as alias name as a child and parents okay then we will write select name first i want a name i will write like that only age then what i will do sorry what i will do i will write from parents is a parents right parent i will write parent only and then i will join with again i will write parent parents is a child so we have prefix we assume one table parent as a parent and the another table parents is a child here what i will do first i want to know the child name right so i will write here child dot name then again i need a age of child i will write child dot age again here i want the name of parent and age of parent so i will write here parent dot name comma again i will write parent dot age okay you can write directly also i am not saying first you have to prefix and then you have to write no i am doing this because it will be easier you to understand okay now this is we have prefix the name Ah, uh, sorry. Table name. Okay. Here we prefix the table's name. Now what we have to do? We have to join these two, right? In joining condition, what we will write? We will write join child dot. Now what I need here? The parent ID first, because we want the 
child parent right so i will write parent id is equal to then parent parent come from this parents table again the child come from this table again okay dot this id we are using here okay id if you will hit control enter you will know name of the child his age his parent name and his age it is very clear to understand now can you see here it is very difficult to understand who is the parents of whose and uh, what is the age of his parents and what is the age of his child but in this scenario it is very clear that john uh, the name of person is john his age is 5 and his parent name is michael and his age is 30 so it is very easy like emily his age is 50 sophia is parent and his age is sophia's age is 80 i hope everybody understand how we can fix the table how we can use a self join and uh, it is very useful you know in the real world that you know how to use alias name it can reduce your lot of work okay thank you so much for today till then happy learning keep supporting and don't forget to subscribe my channel